Well, we've been in the uh, we've been in the sport uh, event market for a little while, and we saw a lot of the uh, OCR obstacle course races coming up from the states. They were really pushing how rah rah, how much pain and sorrow can you endure? And so that's when we came up with the concept of Mud Hero because there's a lot of people out there who still want to have fun, still want to run a challenging uh, event, but but have some fun with their family and friends. And so that's where Mud Hero was born. Uh, we're expecting about 4,000 participants and probably another uh, 1,000 to 1,500 uh, spectators. Uh, we usually take about a week to set it up uh, and it usually takes us about three days to uh, take it all down and uh, move on to our next stop. Uh, our biggest obstacle, uh, or one of our most popular ones, is definitely Mudslide, which is right behind us, um, and Kong, uh, where you where we climb up 14 feet, uh, you go across a uh, section of uh, uh, netting, and then you crawl back down the other side, and then there's Avalanche, which is a uh, which is a quarter pipe, which you have to run up, and, uh, and it's about 12 feet. We have ropes to help you, but a lot of people just like to try to run and catch the top edge. It's really cool. So we do, uh, we, we're across Canada, uh, so we start off in Ottawa, go to Montreal, uh, then we're, we're here this weekend, uh, we're off to Red Deer, Alberta, and then we uh, finish it off in Nova Scotia. It's always very hectic and frenetic on the day of the event, but honestly, like you said, there's a ton of smiling faces, everyone's happy, everyone's uh, you know enjoying the outdoors, and that's really what we want, what we aspire to be at here at Mud Hero, is, is getting people outside, kind of getting them a little bit out of their comfort zone, and having some fun with uh, family and friends. Well, it's always a good idea just to change things up. We were uh, we were up at uh, Hilltop Resort near uh, Grand Marier for about five years, and so yeah, so we said, you know what, like let's change things up, let's move to uh, southern Manitoba and see what it's uh, like, and we've been super happy with the the community they've been great they've been we we just love working with everyone around here yeah we uh really like i said we really appreciate the community support and we're really thankful that everyone in manitoba still loves our event so happy with everything on me <laughs>